All right, Meredith, thank you. We'll check back in with you. We begin the 6 o'clock hour with the latest data breach, this time affecting the Home Improvement Store Home Depot. It's the latest U.S. company to be hacked by identity thieves. And as News Channel 3's Tracy Lair found out, this attack could be one of the worst. Hackers hacked Target during the holidays last year. They may have targeted Home Depot in the spring. My gut reaction is like fear. What are you going to do, you know? Um, shop here every day. The more you use your card, I think the more chance of something bad happening in and, and today's, you know, electronic age. The Atlanta-based home improvement store says it will notify customers if the breach is confirmed. If it is, credit card numbers, expiration dates, and codes accessed from the magnetic strip could be used to make counterfeit cards and online purchases. Cybersecurity expert Brian Krebs said a massive amount of numbers hit the black market Tuesday. They could be linked to Home Depot purchases made in late April or May. I think it's unfortunate. I think it's um, unfortunately a sign of the times that, you know, security has to be one step ahead of fraud <laughs> and the fraud seems to be um, winning. Anything you're doing to protect yourself? Um, changing credit cards frequently, getting new cards, you know, um, making sure that, you know, being in touch with the bank. Sam's Club has already switched to chip cards that use one-time codes, making them nearly impossible to copy. It's, it's necessary to, to change to a system that's not going to get hacked. I mean, that's, that's a, a problem for everybody. I, I'm afraid to shop here now, really. Mark Nelson has two Home Depot credit cards. The handyman says he'll keep shopping at his local store. Last year, I think I spent almost $80,000 here, so can't use cash. Tracy Lair, News Channel 3.